Stillwater has already avoided demolition thanks to a reality TV star. Yeah, interesting story, but now it does need to be fixed up, and doing that is not easy. Fox 9's Ted Haller joining us, or taking a look inside to show us just how tricky this job will be. Watch for nails. Yeah. Nails are just the latest yeah. obstacle to saving this old house. There was the bulldozer incident, stopped mid-demolition by reality TV star Nicole Curtis, then trying to buy the house and property, which finally happened at a cost of $600,000. Got a mask up for upstairs. This house built in 1870 continues to provide drama in 2015. We bought this house, so we need to work to get it. In, back in order. The Washington County Historical Society wants less drama, more history. Thanks. So they're starting to clean out the house they now own. With the goal of restoring it to the era when Reverend William Boutwell, the missionary credited with naming Lake Itasca, lived in it. You may not see it, but they can. Put a couple of bedrooms upstairs, it'd be a great living room. Kitchen over there, yeah, this would be great. Pardon the mess in the meantime, but whoever said history was neat. And it really came down to, if we're not going to do anything, then why are we here? The Washington County Historical Society is still looking for volunteers to help with all those renovations. They're also still trying to raise money. If you want to get involved, we have information on our website. Ted Haller, Fox 9.